My name is Lonnie Hessen, and I'm an occupational therapist. If you think about what occupies your time as a human, occupational therapists can work with any of those performance areas. Occupational therapy is a really creative uh, career. We want our children to be successful in all areas of you know, their occupations, and the occupations of a child are being a student and being a family member and being a peer and being you know, someone who can play successfully. This one is big square. Excellent, this one is a big square, and this one is? No. <gasps> oh my gosh, you got it. Okay, so what are we? Children are much more easily engaged by playful therapeutic options, and I feel that working with kids, you can really almost kind of trick them into therapy because they just feel like they're playing a game with you. So we might take a child through an obstacle course to help with their motor planning. We um, would use different activities like climbing, um, swinging, jumping to help with core strengthening. We also have lots of things that hang from our ceilings like trapezes that we might use to help with children's development of upper extremity and hand strengthening. And sometimes children have handwriting difficulties and they need help with, you know, learning how to write, learning how to hold a pencil. Okay, straight line down. I have to document each session with a daily progress note and I write where the child is in terms of their performance that day. How much help did that child need with the different tasks I asked the child to do so that we can keep track and kind of monitor how the child is progressing in terms of their treatment plan. I got my undergraduate degree in kinesiology, which is uh, human movement studies. You need a master's degree to be able to practice. I applied to graduate schools and chose a program that was uh, two years of academics and then six to nine months of internships after the academics. Even though I'm a pediatric physical therapist, I worked in a hospital setting with adults as one of my internships. If you want to pursue occupational therapy, really think about the sciences. Really think about honing your writing skills in high school. Make sure you stay really active. Make sure you keep your own bodies really strong and really healthy. And make sure that your attitude is really positive. Working with patients or clients in a clinic setting, you have to come into the day with a very positive outlook. You have to leave all your own stuff at home. I love how active I'm able to be every day. Sitting down in a chair for me all day at a job would be really challenging. I love being up and active and moving all day, and I do at this job. I'm up, walking around, helping kids. I love the kids that I work with, and it's a great career, go for it.